And it's a beautiful, beautiful life. life. Oh, come on. <laughs> Hey, what's happening? It's your boy All Around and Ingles. Good morning. I've got a busy day ahead of me with VIP events and filming at the South Street Comedy Club tonight. I'm all packed up and ready to go. I'm taking an assortment of camera support apparatus with me today. I've got two standard tripods I'll be using to film at South Street Comedy Club tonight. A Joby Gorilla Pod to throw my iPhone on just in case the opportunity presents itself. And a monopod I'll be using to shoot some sports photography with this afternoon. When Crystal uses her iPhone 5C for navigation, it doesn't actually talk to her. So she asked me to take a look at it and see if I can figure out how to make it talk. And when I picked it up, I realized it feels so tiny now compared to holding my iPhone 6 Plus all the time. It's such a cute little iPhone. Let's see if we can make it talk. Starting route to use town road. Hey Chris, it works! Okay, so I found out where she was going wrong. After she typed in an address and maps, she was tapping the arrow icon on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen, which just shows you your current location. To actually start navigation, you have to tap on the car icon. Makes me think they really should put text labels inside of these apps so that people who aren't familiar with the icons know what they are. Or at the very least, do what they do in the iMovie app, where they have a little question mark circle in the top right-hand corner. And anytime you need to know what one of the icons is, you just tap that question mark and it puts text labels over top of all the icons and can really help curve the learning curve for those who aren't that familiar with iOS. I'm talking to you, Apple. You should send me the royalty checks when you get that feature implemented. I really want a black tie to go with my outfit today, so I'm going to stop by Walmart and see if I can find one. But just in case I don't, I'll be bringing a backup. Hey guys, Daddy's got to go to work. I'll see you guys in a little while. Good night. I'm Anna and this is Sophia. I'm Nick. I'm Elise. And I'm Maddie. And we're at the 2014 Youth Town Music and Barbecue Fest, and it's it a, a beautiful, beautiful life. I'm VIP Magazine. Just wonder if I can get your guys' photo. Sure. All right. One, two, three. One, two, three. I'm always running into celebrities at these VIP events. Behind me is Mater and Lightning McQueen. I finished photographing the Youth Town Music and Barbecue Festival, and now I'm at my next event, the 2014 Jackson Wolves Blue Suede Invitational Soccer Tournament. I finished shooting the photographs I need for VIP Magazine, and I've been using the Canon EOS 60D camera body with battery grip, the Canon EF 24-105mm L-Series lens, and of course, my handy dandy black rapid strap. And now it's time to bring out the big boy. I've taken the strap off the camera and mounted it to the Sigma 70-200 2.8 and attached it to a monopod. Let's go shoot some sports! Did he seriously just peg him with the ball? And that's how you shoot soccer. Now it's on to Starbucks to look at the photos. Starbucks has these awesome reusable cups you can buy for a dollar. And when you use them to get your drink, you get a discount on it. I'm sitting in Starbucks sipping on a delicious pumpkin spice latte, processing some photos. And I'm sharing a table with Carl, the fruit carver. You can check out his work at thefruitcarver.com. The fruit carver, Carl Franklin Jones, was kind enough to share his table with me in Starbucks so that I could power my laptop and process the photos I shot at the VIP events I covered today. But I ended up doing much more than just processing photos. The hour, hour and a half I spent chatting with Carl is probably one of the most educational, entertaining, and inspiring conversations I've had in a long time. Now it's time to head to South Street Comedy Club to record some comics. <laughs> Y'all are too sweet. I love y'all. That's cool as can be. You have no idea how that's, how that's gonna make him feel more. Thank y'all. I'm from New Jersey, you can probably tell, but met one of these beautiful Tennessee girls, followed her down here, you know. And actually it was more than just her looks though, she also had that wonderful Tennessee accent. You know what I mean? And in fact, I'll never forget the first time I heard her voice, I was in a club, and she came up to me. And she said, hi. You know, I'll go out with you if you buy me a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> I said, really? So what would you do for a carton? 
Now, mind you, cigarettes in New Jersey are like $10 a pack, so it's, it's not like she was some kind of floozy or something. I mean, she was a nice girl. She was a nice girl. Oh, Miley Cyrus got in trouble with that song for twerking on the tape. You remember that? Remember that? Yeah. We've been, we've been twerking for years, happy ladies. We just didn't know it was called that, right? We called it getting a pap smear, yeah? Back me up on this, ladies. It don't matter where you set your ass on that table. What does that doctor say to you? Skip down, skip down, skip down, all right? Another fun and hilarious night at South Street Comedy Club has come to a close. Now I'm heading home to end this very, very long day. But before I do, let me tell you today's song of the day is Life is a Highway by Rascal Flatts. Seeing Mater and Lightning McQueen at U-Town's Music and Barbecue Fest car show made me think of that song, and it's been stuck in my head ever since. If you want to get it stuck in your head, you can go to play.spotify.com and sign into your Spotify account. If you don't have one, you can sign up for free and check out the A Beautiful Life Song of the Day playlist where I have today's and every other pick I've ever chosen for Song of the Day in one massive playlist. Just go to your browser and type in bit.ly slash ablsotd. That stands for A Beautiful Life Song of the Day. Also, while you're in your browser, check out JB Bowman at jbbowman.com. That's JB. B-O-W-M-A-N.com for more hilarious comedy. Very funny guy. And also check out tonight's hilarious headliner, Donna Carter, at DonnaCarter.com. That's D-O-N-N-A-C-A-R-T-E-R.com. And you can check me out at www.rallenangles.com. That's R-A-L-A-N-I-N-G-A-L-L-S.com. Well, I'm finally going to hit the bed, guys. Good night. I'll see you tomorrow. And, and I'm, I never did go to Walmart and get that tie.